It's just like to say to Neil, how lucky he is to get such a beautiful girl like Natasha. <laughs> Hey, Neil. Take you, Natasha. Take you, Natasha. As my wife. As my wife. For better, for worse. For better, for worse. For richer, for poorer. For richer, for poorer. In sickness and in health. In sickness and in health. Till death us part. Till death do us part. That's a photograph of you and Natasha. And the chain. And the chain, look at that, isn't that lovely? See that there? That's a lovely one there, isn't it? Natasha. Take you, Neil. Take you, Neil. As my husband. As my husband. For better, for worse. For better, for worse. For richer, for poorer. For richer, for poorer. In sickness and in health. In sickness and in health. Till death us do part. Till death us do part. I'd like to introduce Natasha for the very first time as my wife, Mrs. Morrison. I definitely feel I definitely feel like the luckiest man in the world standing here as your husband. Natasha, wear this ring as a sign of our love and fidelity in the name of the Father and of the Son and of the Holy Spirit. Neil wore this ring as a sign of our love and fidelity in the name of the Father and of the Son and of the Holy Spirit. I have to say, and wow, you look absolutely amazing. You know, so, so, so beautiful, like, out of this world. My friends, we don't have a Catholic ceremony on formal. You may kiss the bride for us. We can have a warm Seeing you coming down the aisle, it was incredible. I'll just I'll keep this short, but I'll tell you a wee story on how myself and Tasha met. We met in the Boston Paddy's Day in 2013. I saw this gorgeous brunette, big green bow in her hair, big pearly white teeth, and those blue green eyes that would absolutely knock you over. So, <laughs> so over I go with a big shamrock hat on my head and just able to see my face, thinking to myself, what in under God am I going to say to this girl? How do, you, how do you go and pull her? So, as any other Irish potty would say, I went over and said, hello you. <laughs> <laughs> Fancy a drink at the bar? I think, I think my country voice worked because uh, we're sitting here six and a half years later in front of you all beautiful people at the wedding, so hats off. I'm going, to, I'm going to finish off with this little 
Just this little note, especially to the bride and groom. And I hope they listen carefully to me now. I hope they lie, steal, and cheat. Let me explain, everybody. May they lie in a bed of roses. May they steal each other's affection. And may they cheat Father Time.